Atlanta, the Braves' 1990 story hasn't been very compelling, but of late things have been looking up. A tale of justice. Dave Justice, that is. After taking over for Dale Murphy in right field, Mr. Justice feels right at home. I had to think a lot on defense, and I, I can say it did take away a little bit of my, my concentration on hitting. But once I moved back into the outfield, I could devote more time to my, my concentrating on my hitting and uh, thinking about what I was going to do at the plate, and it's worked out all right. I drive to right. Glenn Wilson is out of real estate, and it's gone. Three run homer for David Justice. Justice has hit for power and average. His sweet swing reminds some folks of a Hall of Fame slugger who once played for the Chicago Cubs. Talking about Billy Williams. Dave, uh, in my mind, was always a true hitter, a true swinger. He had a swing, to me, similar to Billy Williams. And uh, if he achieves what Billy did, uh, we've got a great player in our hands. And he is a great player. He's a great right fielder, good arm, runs good. He likes to win. And that's what I like about him is his makeup. And if justice has its way, Dave should become the National League's Rookie of the Year. His uniform number tells you how many homers he's already hit. I think it's probably going to be between uh, Delano DeShields and Dave Justice. And uh, I tell you what, as far as helping out the team, Dave has really helped us a great deal. And uh, if they go on that, then he should win it. Another brave in mind for a postseason award is Ron Gant, could win comeback player of the year. After spending much of last year in the minors, Gant has enjoyed a career season. I think last year helped me a great deal mentally because uh, I work harder now. My work habits are a lot better than they have been because I don't want to go through that anymore. And, it, and uh, you know, I'm doing anything I can to have a good year here in the major leagues. Good year might be an understatement. Gant's on a pace to hit 30 homers. Here's the one two to Gant. Driven high and deep to left field. Hatcher's going to watch this one go out of here. Run combines home run power with speed. Might even wind up becoming only the eighth National Leaguer to become a member of baseball's 30-30 club. 30 homers, 30 stolen bases. Yeah, I really think he's going to do that this season, and for next year, he would repeat on that very easily. In my mind, he could steal more than 30 bases. There's very few catchers and pitchers that can hold him and, uh, and throw him out. A combination of power and speed. Rare indeed. And add to that, a touch of maturity. All the things that have happened to me, it made me grow mentally um, as well as physically. And uh, I feel like uh, I've grown up a lot. Now our Players of the Week, brought to you by Gatorade. Batters up, Dave Justice, Ron Gant. In a win over the first place Cincinnati Reds, they tomahawked back-to-back -back round trippers. Gant belted home run number 26. And on the very next pitch, Justice hit number 22. There's another drive. And he killed this one. A few more votes for Rookie of the Year. 